The schools to benefit include Kahunikwa Primary, Onduludia Combined School, and the Hurundrai Primary Schools. MTC's Chief Human Capital Corporate Affairs and Marketing Officer Tim Ekanjo expressed dismay over challenges such as lack of or dilapidated classrooms faced by many schools in the country. This, he says, results in many children being taught in unconducive environments and therefore must be radically addressed in a collective approach. Very important how we identify the schools. We have access to all the regional education directors and we would say to them, we want to commit to two regions this year and the regional education directors will then say to us, this is the worst school in the region that needs the most attention and we will then pick that school. So once we are done with all the regions, we will then go back and start with where we started and we will then go and pick the second uh, worst school in that region. Uh, so in a nutshell, that is really what we want to do and if there is like-minded partners out there, uh, for instance at Hundrai Primary School, we have two partners already um, that are going to put up um, the hostel. And the total number of learners are 376. Uh, Principal of Kahunikwa Primary School in Zambezi, Maseni Nalishebo, says current situations at the school is demoralizing learners and often makes concentration in class difficult due to poor infrastructure. We have classroom challenges. The classroom challenges at our school are one, the physical environment of the classrooms does not support teaching and learning. The classrooms are full of dust. At Hrundrai Primary School, there are only five classrooms and they are not conducive for learning. Uh, five classrooms at the moment, one which is still intact, two dilapidated classrooms which are not conducive for, for our teaching as well as two corrugated um, IM classrooms, which are also in a bad state, um, which is not conducive for the learning, learning environment for learners, which is leaking during our rainy season, very hot in the summers and very cold in the winters. MTC, through its rural schools, has to date spent $5 million, which benefited five schools. The MTC Rural Schools Project was launched in 2020 and is driven to better the learning environment for learners through building and or revamping classrooms.